up? It's Ashley here and for today's video, I'm going to be doing 30 life, food, and iPhone hacks for you guys because I know one of my most popular videos is my 25 life hacks for girls. Oh my god, that video got like 200,000 views, which is crazy to me. Like, a lot of people viewing my videos. So, um, I decided to do, well, okay. So, I decided to do another one. And some of these were told to me by my parents. Life hacks that they gathered over time throughout their life. The ones I just found on the internet. So yeah, if you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up at any time and let's just get started. Alright, let's start. Life hack number one. I'm gonna tell you guys what your tears mean. So you know when you cry and your tear come from the right eye, it should be the opposite direction. I'll throw the camera but okay. When you cry from your right eye, that means it's happiness and if you cry from your left eye, then that means it's pain. I didn't know that before so I thought it was pretty cool. Number two. When you go shopping, the cheapest items will not be at eye level, but on the top or bottom shelves. Number three, I don't know about you guys, but during the colder months, I really like drinking tea. So drink green tea if you're feeling sick or tired or you just want to lose some weight. Drink chai tea if you're feeling sluggish or you have a stomach ache. Drink oolong tea if you are breaking out or you want to burn some fat. And drink peppermint tea if you're prone to headaches or just sore. So yeah, those are some benefits of tea. Number four, I've never been to a concert my whole life so that's on my bucket list but when you go to a concert and you want to film I don't know 1d on stage with your phone put your finger over the microphone of the phone like right here this area put it over here so when you record the video um, the volume will be much clearer when you play it back number five make glow-in-the-dark nail polish it's really easy all you have to do is break a glow stick in half pour that into clear nail polish and mix it up and you got yourself some clear not clear glow-in-the-dark nail polish I haven't tried this out yet but um, I think it'll probably work and my birds are really annoying right now they're like really loud I'm so sorry about that but yeah because it was really cold today so my brother decided to let them in moving on eating orange before you work out not only will it keep you hydrated it also prevents your muscles from being sore so <laughs> when starting a game of rock or scissors always start with paper because most people start with rocks I don't know if this is scientific most people just start with rocks because it's the easiest shape that hand can form um, so you know when you do paper you win or it can be the vice versa I don't know here are some stress relieving foods bananas pasta almonds grapes green tea oatmeal chocolate watermelon orange juice cornflakes and tuna so eat those if you want to relieve some stress I guess number nine turning off the flash on your camera app will save batteries even if you're not using the camera app I didn't know that until today number 10 massage your nails with coconut oil to make them strong and healthy number 11 so I actually saw this on Michelle Fawn's a video a long time ago if you're shopping and you don't want to go in a changing room to change on the pants you want but you still want to see if it fits you go ahead and wrap it around your neck and if the ends touch each other that means that it will fit I saw her doing it it worked so I thought it was pretty cool so you're welcome. Okay, I don't know if this ever happened to you guys, but when I do my nails, sometimes I just like spill the nail polish bottle and sometimes it spills out or like it somehow just gets smudged on the table or on the floor and I just keep scrubbing it and it never comes off. What you can do is take sugar and pour it onto the nail polish stain and the sugar will make the nail polish clump up and it's easier to clean off so you can just swipe it out instead of scrubbing it. I didn't know this before today. I was like, oh my god, like what? Like smudge blowing, boom. Okay, yeah. No special effects because I'm poor, so. This one is kind of mean, but you know when you have those like friends that are really annoying and you just want to like stop talking to them, but you don't want to be rude? So what you can do is send them this message that I'll put on the screen right now and I can't remember, so I have to read it on my phone. Service error 305. Message delivery failed. Further messages will be charged to your account. I guess they'll scare them off a little bit. Stop! Sorry, that was my burst. They are really annoying. Next life hack. Did you know that being sarcastic on a daily basis will actually extend your lifetime? I didn't know that, but um, I guess it makes sense because if you're being sarcastic, I guess you're moving your brain more. And, you know, it's really healthy for your brain being sarcastic. So, be sarcastic. <laughs> I haven't tried this one out, but you know when your car is like super hot in the afternoon? Basically, you want to roll down your windows and then go to the other side of the car, open and close the door a few times, and it'll cool the car off. In a public restroom, choose the stall closest to the door. The chances are it's cleaner. I usually go to the first stall that's closest to me. I don't know if it's just me, but it's usually pretty clean there. So yeah. Here are some more food hacks. Here are just some food that will boost your metabolism. Almond, spinach, cold water, turkey, Salmon, hot peppers, oatmeal, blueberries, coffee, ginger, yogurt, and green tea. Did I say coffee? I think I did. Uh, okay. Story time. So, I went to Florida over the past summer, as you guys probably know if you follow my social media. 
Self promotions. Okay, I went there uh, for a vacation and we went to Disney World and I just never know where my dad parks his car, nor does he. So we always have a hard time finding our way back. Stop, Burns! Drop a pin on your phone, the Google Maps or whatever, um, as soon as you get there and then you can just follow Google's way back, I guess. <laughs> I wish I knew this before, but I didn't. I just took a picture of the pole and we never knew where it was. I don't know. Oh, it, was, it was bad. But it was really fun though. Not the part we can't get back to the car, but the amusement park part. If you want to lose some weight, here are some basic weight loss tips that will help you and I think every dietitian or healthy lifestyle video includes and that is to drink water, exercise obviously, limit your carbs to one time per day and no fast food, no sugar, like not no sugar but like no like donuts or fries or candies or chocolate. And number five is just adjust your portion sizes. Oh, the plane is really loud. So adjust your portion sizes so you can eat little by little, and then your body will get used to eating less. Well, I just realized like this garland thing he fell off like two minutes after I started talking, and I didn't know until I looked back at the footage. Next life hack. The most powerful way to win an argument is by asking questions. I actually tried this one out and it worked. So I fight with my brother all the time. So basically, I ask him questions and I'll be like, "Why do you think you're so?" cool or whatever and he'll be like uh because and he'll just like lose track of what he's trying to say so like that's how you can like beat him up verbally i guess that's the most powerful way to win an argument so when you're texting on the iphone and you're texting someone elder or someone you want to be respectful to like your grandmother or whatever hit a space bar twice not only will it make a period for you on the end of the sentence so you don't have to flip to the next page and find a period and also it'll capitalize your next letter so that's a win-win Make DIY paint! Mix one cup of salt and one cup of flour and one cup of water and add in any food coloring you want to make your DIY paint. You know when you like go to movie theater and you're like, ah, oh, watch a movie and then someone sits in front of you and then you just can't see that well because their head is like on the top? <laughs> Leave a jacket in front of the seat in front of you and no one will sit there. Deodorant will actually help stop an insect itch or insect bite. And I actually had an insect bite like right here and it was super itchy like two days ago and I was like, oh my god, this is so itchy. And uh, what I did was take a deodorant and just like rubbed it like a few times and it stopped the itch. And which is kind of cool, but you might think it's kind of disgusting because you put your deodorant under your armpit. But if you have two deodorants, then you can, you know, do that. But yeah. If you guys play sports this fall, you might get bruises on your knees. What you can do is take a cotton ball, soak it into vinegar, and start rubbing over the bruise, and it'll make the bruise disappear. If you need to get motivated, take a shower. This is like my life hack, basically. I wake up from a nap, and I'm like so tired, like, oh, I don't want to do homework or study or whatever. Then I take a shower, and it just kind of keeps my brain like focused more a little bit. Because being clean is actually proven to increase your productivity, or productivity, whatever, however you say it, so you can get motivated again. Did you know that you can get free coffee from Starbucks on your birthday or I think any other drink? Go to Starbucks and be like, hey, it's my birthday, can I have a free drink or whatever? Then they'll probably give it to you because it's your birthday. You can also lie and be like, it's my birthday. But only do it like once a year or if there's a different cashier. <laughs> I guess. I actually saw Blog Lotties do this on her um, video for her healthy food video. You know those Tumblr perfect eggs? The egg yolk is perfect and then the egg white surrounds it. And I never cook it like that. I always flip it and it's like burned or, or just yellow all over because I mixed the egg. What you can do is take an ice cube and put it into the pot, put the cap on, and basically it'll make a perfect egg because the ice will dissolve. I don't know how it works, but I saw her doing her video and it worked for her, so I guess it probably works. Now, I actually learned this from, from my mom a few days ago. I bought a pair of white adidas and it is so dirty because it rained a few days ago. They're covering dirt and whatever and I'm like ah. Oh. So my mom told me to get a old toothbrush and a toothpaste and just use the toothpaste to scrub off all the dirt or just anything like brown parts that stain your shoe and it works and that, that was pretty cool so yeah. The last life hack is for those Froyo lovers out there and actually Froyo is one of my favorite foods and I love Froyo but it's usually a little expensive when you go out to like a Froyo place so what you can do is take your yogurt and put it in the freezer my brother actually taught me this he just like did it one day he's like hey look actually eat that frozen yogurt and just put it in the freezer for 30 minutes to an hour and then take it out and either blend it up in a blender to make it more like a froyo consistency or just eat it like that and it tastes like froyo and saves you a few extra bucks so yeah so that is about it for today's video that's all the 30 life hacks if you try out any of these life hacks or if you have more life hacks to share drop them in the comments below so everyone can make life easier just like that. Okay, I can't snap. I can never snap. Like, 
I don't know how to snap basically. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any other requests, leave them in the comments below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!